new location, new company. I'm super excited today. So this is a company um, that I have had my eye on forever for probably, I was looking at my, um, looking at my email from I think it was like 2018, 2019. So it's been like two, three years. Um, anyways, I just finally got around to pulling the trigger on them and they caught my eye for a few reasons. One, um, they're local-ish. They're in California at NorCal, San Francisco. Um, which I like to know where my stuff is designed and produced and I like sort of the, um, and here's the wrapping just so you can see it. Um, I don't know, I feel like connected to the product and I feel like there's a lot, a lot of choices um, out there these days and I want to know like that where I spend my dollars I feel good about it uh, and this is definitely one of those places. So what caught my eye, oh my god so cute, look at that. You know I like it when um, things are thoughtfully packaged, and like this is super thoughtfully packaged. The heart is no, um, it's no coincidence, by the way. Um, so they caught my eye because they have probably the most thoughtfully designed women's work bags, and a lot of times I feel like women's work bags are this like afterthought, wherein the laptop fits, but that's it. Like that's all I could say about it, the laptop is. It's not like designed to be laptop worthy. Um, oh my gosh, look at this. This is so cute. Look at how cute this crossbody wallet is. And see what I asked them to put in the corner? That little heart. Um, so anyways, I'm super excited about this. It's, um, I don't really have like a crossbody wallet where it's really just a wallet and then um, it also has the purse strap, so I'm super excited about this. I think this has been redesigned a few times. This was actually the first thing that caught my eye when I saw them, like, um, a long time. Ooh, it's very soft in there. It's like a micro suede or something in there. Um, and I don't know. I just, there aren't that many companies, small companies, that sincerely, like, cater to that niche. This is really nice, by the way. Um, so I guess there were three things, ultimately. It was local... It's um, genuinely designed a lot of the pieces to be um, catering to the working woman. And then, sorry, I'm like being clumsy today. This is cute. It comes with a wristlet strap and it comes with the um, crossbody. I'm gonna open it because I'm kind of curious about it. But, um, and then also that they have, like, if you go to their website, and I'll, I'll obviously put the links for you below. Um, if you go to their website, you'll see that, like, they take their leather seriously. They're not just designing the bag. Um, they're crafting each piece, and that includes, like, a dedication to finding the right leather. So it's one of the few places where I saw where they, you know, uh, besides the other companies that are already featured, where they s sincerely spend time, like, talking about the leather on their website, um, and that it's full grain, and that it's meant to last, and all these things, and that's something that's super important to me, right? Um, I'm not into sort of the fast fashion of purses where you have it for a season and then it's done. Um, for a lot of reasons, including, let me do this because I just want to see, I'm like very curious. Um, sustainability and a focus on the environment that it's important to me that these pieces that you buy, they're not like, gosh, it was like meant to be, you know, I wear my purses super short. I'm like very excited about this. Uh, I'm going out to Costco, which is um, one of the few places that I, I go to during the pandemic. So I think I'm going to take this little beauty with me. But um, I feel like it's love at first sight because A, the strap is somehow already magically set to my height. Um, it has the continuous loop. You know, I don't like the dangling tail if I can get away with it. And they monogram the heart. So they have actually a lot of monograms. Um, and I toyed with a couple things, but I'm super happy with my choice. Um, and that is not it. So let me put this to the side. Okay, sorry about that. I do not like going off camera. Um, so they have a lot of pieces that I really wanted to try, but they most recently had this like insane sale. Um, let's see about this. Oh, cute. It's a little thing about, speaking of, that we use full grain leather. All, I'll put this up so that you could um, so that you could read, but it's really interesting. Like it spoke to me. So they talk about sustainably sourcing their leather, um, and they just talk about 
the process. And so it's attractive to me that you know who's, who you're buying from, that it's local, um, and that it's not just some giant corporation. So uh, that spoke to me. I'm being very disjointed and I apologize, it's like starting off on these tangents. Um, but they had this amazing sale and I thought, this is the time for me to sort of jump in and try it. Uh, and so I got this giant tote in this gray that I'm so excited about. And I have a couple other pieces that I think I'm probably gonna end up expanding to. They have like this laptop bag that's really, um, I don't know why, but it's just like, it really speaks to me. I did not get the laptop bag this time around. Oh, it's cute. It says, oh, so foggy. And it's um, it's like a, a, not a panda bear, what do you call it? The white ones, a polar bear. Um, and foggy is the color that I got. I'm super excited. This coat comes in two sizes. I'm just gonna rip it. I'm kind of feeling like a Christmassy kind of day. Oh my God. And I went with a large coat. I was kind of like, oh gosh, it's really pretty. So um, it's funny, like filming in your front yard, I keep like looking up, like are the neighbors gonna walk by? Uh, ooh, look at this, so secret pocket back here, and I think it's like lined with a, again, that suede. Oh, I like this, because I don't like fighting with the um, snaps. Generous front pocket, this is a nice size bag. I'm very excited. We're kind of learning together, because I didn't do, Okay, so these, this is one of the companies that like really is catering to women. These are straps that this bag can hang from your stroller. Um, they're actually really nice straps. So I'll, I'm embarrassed to say I still have my stroller. So I will, um, I will debut that for you on my review. Uh, so keep an eye out. And I, so let me know if you want me to pack it out for a diaper bag. I have plenty of girlfriends that I could borrow their stuff. Um, but it's a super nice size bag, it's large. Look at this. This is cute, it's like a key belt. I don't know what you call it. I always call it a key belt where it like hides your keys and then they tuck back in there and it's got the key, got the, um, the dog leash clasp. I like that it's separate. So you could like move it from bag to bag or place it where you want in the bag. This bag has a lot of features. Um, so I'm gonna try and walk you through some of them. So, on the side closest to you, and I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this. I think this will be easier for us. I'm not feeling like I was up in my neck. But um, let me do this. It has a ton of features. On the side closest to me, it has a zippered pocket, and it's a good size. Like I could fit my giant phone in there. On the side closest to you, it has an open pocket, and then this is one of the things that I've always, I always thought if I designed a bag, this would be the top on my list. I never understood why it wasn't um, in more people's bags. You know I'm crazy about my coffee. So this is the coffee sleeve, um, and it comes like with a Velcro attachment. So if you use coffee and you wanna put that in your bag and keep it separate, you don't want it like, even though they suppose, supposedly are like leak proof, you don't want that like loose in your bag. Um, I love this, and it's kind of like, it feels nylon to me. So if a little bit of coffee spills, no big deal. I like that you can take it in and out. And this tucks right here on the my right seam. Let's see what other goodies there are in here. I'm like super excited. Um, this is the crossbody strap. It's got a pad on it, which is super nice. It's got the endless loop, no tail. These feel good. Not super heavy, but let me do that. And then let's see what else is in here. It's just like a tote with sort of all the bells and whistles and the price point's really, really nice. So this is just a clutch, a makeup bag, a carry-all, a de facto wallet, whatever you need it to be. It, um, and I say de facto wallet because it's actually really nice. So it's got one, two, three credit card slots in there. And it's kind of got like a, a makeup bag feel to it. Like you could wipe it out. Uh, the outside is full grain leather. There's a lot of thoughtful details on this bag, right? Like they could have just had the, zip, the zipper, but they actually have a leather zipper pull. And then it comes with this clutch attachment. I feel like these are so key. One day I'm gonna be back in the office again, um, and this is gonna be my lunch purse. But even if it's not, I feel like it's just really nice to have those things for when you like leave your big bag in the car and then you run into Trader Joe's. Um, it's got a really roomy interior and it's got that sort of like micro suede lining that I, I mentioned. It's really nice. I'm very impressed. 
I also have, in case, let me make sure, show you like this, but you could snap this, and I can't really see, so I'm not gonna do it, but I'll figure it out and then I'll show you, so that if you wanted the bag to have a smaller silhouette, like if you didn't need it at full capacity, you could do that. Um, so I like that option. I like the dual carry option. I think I'd make this a little bit shorter, but I love, and we're gonna try this together, although historically I don't have a lot of luck with trying these things on camera. Um, but I like the carry options. I like that the, st the short straps tuck in if you don't wanna use them. Let's do this. Did I shorten it or lengthen it? I can never tell. Um, I definitely did something to it. Here, maybe it's like this. Um, there we go, I think we're making progress. Are we making progress? Or did I lengthen it? I believe I lengthened it, yeah, see? Here, let's try again. <laughs> uh, let's go the other way, let's do this. Okay, there we go. Now I shortened it, I believe. Um, so I want you to see what it looks like. Now I think we are getting somewhere. Yeah, that feels shorter. Oh, that feels good. Um, so I just feel like, it, oh, it's very comfortable actually. Let's make sure this is not twisted. I started to, um, I started to slowly go back out. I've been fairly like quarantined. Um, and I've started to like eat out again in like very socially distanced places. Uh, and I think I'm going to take this out. I feel like this is my welcome back to the world bag. Um, this is their large women's tote in foggy and it's uh, oh so foggy per their cute little thing. I will test drive this. I will get back to you. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. If you want to know what fits, what doesn't fit, how it looks on the stroller, I will test drive all of that for you. I don't even need to tell you that it's most definitely laptop worthy. It's quite generous in size. Uh, the leather feels amazing. It's that leather going to last a lifetime. This is Era 81 out of San Francisco. Thank you so much for watching and I'll be back soon. Take care.